Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to use the Outlook application or Outlook calendar as a to-do list. So this should be a pretty straightforward process, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is select the little check mark on a clipboard icon. Just go ahead and left click on that. And this is going to be your to-do list. So I figured we should start off by selecting new task up at the top here. And now at this point, you go ahead and insert whatever task you want to do. So you could say, you know, wash the car. And you can name the subject whatever you want again. So it doesn't really matter. And you do the start date. If you want to select a certain day of the week, you want to set this for. And then a due date and then the status. If you want to set that in progress or completed, you can modify this as you complete the task as well. And you can also add what percent complete it is. Once you're done, you're going to go ahead and select Save and Close. And now you'll notice that there should be a list on here that will come up where it says there are reminders for it. So you can see tasks by date. So you can see next week we have a task on here. If you open it up, you can see what's listed in here. And you can also adjust it as well. You can mark it as complete by selecting the Mark as Complete button. You can remove it from the list as well as if you want to change what the due date is and the follow-up required. So a pretty straightforward process on that, guys. You can also forward it to a different email address as well if you want to notify it to someone else. And that's pretty much it. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.